Nice little family. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna do a quickie right now. I'll give you items to choose from. The Mojave Turquoise Ring. The Rainbow Crystal Bracelet. The Soulmate Pendant. And that's it. This has got Rhodonite, Ruby, Amethyst, Garnet, Rose Quartz, and two hearts joined together. These are all, this is the Soulmate Pendant, okay? So the, uh, I, I was over the, um, I was over the uh, decks that I was working with. <laughs> and I thought, all right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go in. I've, I've retired some, I, I, this is what I do. I've got hundreds of decks. And so I, I moved them around and I've brought out several new ones and I've, not new, but n ones I haven't used in a while and then and put others away. So today, the ones that I brought back out were the Magical Unicorns, uh, the Keepers of Light, and Ask and It Is Given. So we're gonna start, we're gonna get one message for each um, item. So for the Mojave Turquoise, Keepers of Light. This is interesting. One night I was going to do a reading and I said to Spirit, which deck shall I use? And they said the Keepers of Light. And I thought, I don't have that deck. And so I called um, Sedona Crystal Magic and I said, do, do you have a deck called the Keepers of Light? And they said, yeah, we do. But I looked at it and I thought, you know what? I don't need to spend another $29 right now on a deck. So I went online and I got it for cheaper and it came. And it's a really trippy deck because the... I've been getting a lot about Moses. I had been before I moved here from California. I've been getting a lot about Moses, the story of Moses, what Moses went through, the fact that Moses stuttered and he had his brother speak for him. There's a lot of messages about Moses. And then Lily. Lily is uh, my cat, right? Which was um, my mother's energy. And Kyle, which is, and then Gray. Kyle is a cousin. I don't know why. And Gray makes me think of, um, um, What's his name? You know the guy on uh, Fifty Shades of Grey? Made me think of that, the cousin like that. So then I look at this and this deck is, is the artwork is by Lily Moses. And I thought, whoa, there's just a lot of connections personally for me. So for those who chose the Mojave, Mojave Turquoise, and maybe the message in here for you is something to do with the cousin who has a life like, uh, like Christian Grey. <laughs> Correct for neutrality on all levels. Correct neutrality spirit. I'm very, very low energy right now. Really, really low energy. Uh, my girlfriend sent me some Jasper pieces and I literally have them in each side of my bra like a breastplate. They are, um, I, I, I shared the meaning of them when I, I always, I usually do a video online when I open up my presents, but I'm so exhausted that I just, ugh. I, I did a video and it just was hideous and I thought I'll just take some pictures from it. And it's amazing. If you look at a picture and I'm standing in the light in the kitchen and I look completely healthy and happy and fine, but I, my energy is not that. That picture doesn't show really what is the truth of this situation. So um, the crystal, she was worried about the pieces coming, the gifts coming late. And I said, you know, I know when they come, they're gonna come when they're meant to come. And both were Jasper. One was, they're both raw Jasper. One was Picasso Jasper. But Jasper is known as the supreme nurturer. I'm still asking them to pull a card. Um, it sustains and support, supports us through times of stress and brings tranquility and wholeness. It provides protection and absorbs negative energy, which is being fired at me. It balances yin and yang, and it clears electromagnetic and environmental pollution, including radiation. So, you know, computers, whatever. So I thought, wow, that came right in time for me. <laughs> so everything is, you know, there are no coincidences. Song right now, sorry it's hard to catch my drift. I need a lover to trust. Tell me you're on my side. Are you down for the ride? Well, interesting. I was watching a new Netflix series last night. I decided to let myself just shut down and and chill out and I never normally do that I normally work until late late and then I fall into bed but I've been watching a Netflix series and this guy looks like the guy the lead guy in the series that I was watching and I said I'll take one of him <laughs> I'll take him so I find that interesting that the inter the divine protector the divine director there's a message in that show me where your love lies a lot of lies going on so the divine director um, and, and, and I was just talking about the, uh, about the 
energy of the of the jasper crystal and that's what's happening here sometimes spirit says if we need to intervene we will you know we will step in and it doesn't necessarily come in the way that you imagine oh that means that someone's gonna call or someone's gonna do this no we're gonna send you two pieces of jasper that we're gonna have we're gonna intuitively have you pre press to each side of your breastplate like a breast I, I heard in my head breastplate of righteousness but oftentimes warriors would go into battle with crystals underneath underneath their breastplate to protect them so this is the divine protector coming forward and he talks about intervention and purpose telling you that divine intervention is occurring at this time. You're being guided. You're being guided. I love this. This is for those who chose the... Why did I lose the name of it? Mojave. Mojave Turquoise. Mojave Turquoise is, is mined here in Arizona. It's in Kingman, Arizona, um, which I found was very interesting. And what was more interesting is that when I went to the crystal shops around here, I couldn't find any. They didn't have any. And I was like, okay, I mean, it's so strange that it would be mined in this place. It's kind of like Bing cherries. I come from Canada, right? North Vancouver, British Columbia. And we, are, we have Bing cherries, but we ship them here to you guys. <laughs> All the Bing cherries are down here. So right now, this one is connected to God's plan. God's plan is the ultimate plan, right? The divine plan. When, when we get, it's up to the divine, divine timing, you know, if, if need be, divine intervention will take place. That is God directing this one, right? So this one works directly with our archangels and our guardian angels to help us fulfill the roles that we are meant to fulfill here on this earth. And what's happening right now is divine intervention taking place at your time. You may not understand why it's happening, but you're going to become more and more aware of what your purpose here is. It may have to do with a career shift in your life. But uh, you're moving towards, you are intuitively being guided in the right direction. You're following the right direction. And Spirit says, we want you to continue to move forward, okay? So that's the first message coming forward. I'm going to ask for a message for, from my deck. I'm going to do this quickly. And I hope we don't get interrupted because I didn't put my, my call on. Do not disturb. Father, please guide my fingers to the right message. I'll just get two. There's sacred geometry on his outfit. Yes, I want us. I just need a little time alone. Yes, I want us. I just need a little time alone. Next message, please. You need to choose now or lose her or him. This one's saying I need a little time alone and spirit saying you need to choose now or you're going to lose them. You don't get more time alone or you're going to get Constant time alone. Correct for neutrality on all levels. For those who chose the... What do we have here? We had the crystal bracelet. I love this. So I'm going to go to the magical unicorns. They stand out to me as far as crystals. Correct for neutrality on all levels. Um, I was just told that I should also give you guys a heads up. Um, wow, I didn't even know I didn't have my work line turned off. I should give you guys a heads up on the main main spiritual meaning of Mojave Turquoise. So, the fact that, it, first of all, I'm going to say before I even look at it, the fact that it's these colors, this is the different various shades of green and gold. Gold is about self-worth, worthiness. Green is love, healing, abundance, right? So, turquoise in itself is a stone that focuses on self-love. Oh, that's why I put it on. Self-love. You, if you don't love yourself, you're no help to anyone else, right? It's said to focus its energy on self-forgiveness and self-acceptance. Wow. So, right now, this message that comes out is practice. Practice makes perfect, right? Here's somebody training her unicorn. Here you go. Stand up for yourself is what she's saying. Don't worry about the money coming. Money will be brought to you. I find that interesting. She's playing maybe a musical instrument like a tambourine, but immediately what I saw was a pentacle. And she's telling this guy, she didn't say, here, you know, sit, jump, you know, giving this, or this unicorn orders. She's saying, stand up for yourself. You're a unicorn. Practice standing up for yourself. Practice putting yourself first. Practice self-love. 
the best way to, go, to get good at it is to practice it. Practice it until you get it right. You can use this in regards to anything that's going on. If you feel that there's something that you're not doing very well, then you keep practicing at it. But to me today, the message is you need to practice standing up for yourself. You need to practice self-love. You've got somebody here saying, don't worry about the money. The money's going to come. You stand for yourself. You are a freaking unicorn. Unicorn means you are rare. You are one of a kind. You are magical. Do not forget that. You are worthy. You are worthy of the best. Self-love. That's the message for this one. Correct for neutrality on all levels. Practice standing up for yourself. I like that a lot. Correct for neutrality on all levels. For those who chose the Mojave Turquoise, I love you like a sister, brother, or cousin. I love you like a sister, brother, or cousin. You're either saying that to someone or you need to. I love you like a sister, brother, or cousin. Oh, man, two came out. I didn't realize. Stop stalking me. I'm over it. Okay, that's that's amazing. <laughs> I, I've got stalkers too. Stop stalking me. I'm over it. I love you like a sister, brother, or cousin. Not the way you want, right? You blew me off. No more chances. Wow. <laughs> wow. There you go. Bam, bam, bam. You blew me off. No more chances. Stop stalking me. I'm over it. I love you like a sister, cousin, or brother. Because stalking isn't getting anywhere right? You're stalking someone. Don't let go of me and let me move on. If that's all you're going to do, get out of my life permanently. Don't stalk me. I don't need it. I don't want it. And this is how I feel about you. And then you blew me off. No more chances. Sorry. Correct for neutrality on all levels. For those who chose the soulmate conglomeration, and I do. No. No. I don't choose that one. My focus is on the Mojave one, self-love. Correct for neutrality on all levels. What popped out and made itself very obvious, also with the colors of self-love, look at that. Every subject is two subjects, wanted and not wanted. So there is what you desire, right? And then there's the lack of what you desire. And often when you're thinking about what you don't have, you're in that place of lack. So when you believe that you're thinking about something that you desire, you're actually thinking about the opposite of that. You're actually drawing towards you the opposite of that, right? So think about that. Two subjects, wanted and not wanted. I want this. Well, that means you don't have it. I'm open to this. That'd be great. But I'm focusing on this. So put your focus on what you have that you're grateful for. Don't put your focus on what is not there. Enjoy the journey, right? Correct for neutrality on all levels. What is the message that's appropriate for this? The, the um, whale totem is, is about honoring your soul's path. Somebody's assisting this one, saying, come on, let's go. I will help you go across your emotional waters, but it is time for you to so follow your soul's path. You'll, be, you'll find assistance all along your way, all along the journey. You will, so, oh, hello, you will get the job, position, house, car, etc. Yes. <laughs> right? Don't worry about it. We are going to assist you. We're guiding you. Go with the flow. You're going to have what you need come along at the right time. You're going to be the right place at the right time to get the assistance that you need. This one is taking you, helping you fulfill your, your life purpose. And you're going to get the position, job, house, car, whatever it is that you're concerned with. Correct for neutrality on all levels. Take that leap you're considering. There you go. Because you will get the job, car, house, etc. that you're thinking about. Follow and honor your soul's path. You will get what you need. <laughs> Love it. All right, you guys. Thanks. Talk to you soon. Love you.